Okay, hey YouTube. So, what I wanted to tell you guys today, let me show you. First, I, I want to look at you guys, okay? What I wanted to show you guys, I want to give you a quick recipe on a great protein, um, just some great protein. And I also want to give you a recipe on a vegan tuna. Hold on. Um, okay. So, I'm going to show you what I made. I didn't have time, actually, to actually make it in front of you. But I just want to show you guys this. See this? This is a vegan tuna. See? Okay. So, let me give you my recipe. Okay. Now, because it's always good to um, have other options in healthy eating, healthy snacks. And before I became vegan, before I became vegan, my number one, um, the number one snack that I used to love was um, tuna. I used to eat tuna all day and night. So, what I did was, let me see if I have any in here. Um, I boiled them all. But what I did was, this is the recipe for a vegan tuna. You want to get chickpeas. Okay? You can either do organic uh, chickpeas in the pan in the can or you can do um or you can boil organic chickpeas or if you have a garden you can get them out your garden and what you want to do is you want to have a vita mixer where's my oh it's over there you want to have your vita mixer you get your chickpeas and your vita mixer you put your chickpeas inside the vita mixer and you start blending them. But you want to blend it to where it's like a chunk thing going on. And it's okay if you leave a few peas that that may be still kind of whole. Okay, when you finish that, you want to put them in a bowl. Just like this, see, here. You want to put them in a bowl. And after you place them in the bowl, you just start adding the things that you added when you... Um, had your, you know, when you made your tuna. But I'm going to show you what the main thing that I use. Hold on. So the main thing that I use is this vegan mayo. So I would get my, I would get my, I would get my um, chickpeas and I would put the vegan mayo I would put the vegan mayo in with the chickpeas. After that, I would cut up some red onions, bell pepper, celery. I would use a ground vegan mustard. Um, and I would use some organic sweet relish. And you just mix it all together. And I also use a little garlic powder, onion powder, and I just mix it all together to my tasting and you can do it to your tasting and I'm telling you you get it you put it on some crackers like Ritz crackers if that's what you want or you can put it on some Ezekiel bread or you can put it on like a nice whole grain whole wheat bread and I'm telling you it tastes just it, it doesn't taste like tuna but um, it gives you that tuna taste because of the onions and the bell peppers and that crunch and the little mustard and all of those other seasonings, seasonings I just told you about. So this is a great, um, this is a great protein, a very great protein. Um, let's just say if you have a child and the child don't like beans, you can possibly give them this and they would possibly just go go with the flow okay it's good okay 
Let me show you. Hold on. And I'm going to put the um, ingredients to this and everything I just said in the description box. Let me show you another great protein snack. These are brown rice cakes. Y'all see this? Brown rice cakes. And I believe I got these from Kroger. But also all these have these brown rice cakes, which they are thin, but they really taste good. And what I usually do, I usually put a natural peanut butter on them, or I use tahini butter, which has a lot of great benefits. And also tahini butter, along with this, gives you great, great protein. And it's great. It's a great snack. For you and the kids. And it's not fattening. Also. This is great protein. Roasted cashews. Organic. Great great protein. Just a handful a day. Will also keep your colon cleanse. Also. Let me tell you what else I found. This great. Great protein here. Great protein. 10 grams of protein. Um. It is dark chocolate, whole grain clusters. If you have a chocolate, if you're trying to get off chocolate, but you want to stay healthy and you want the monkey off your back, this here, I got this from Kroger. See that? Dark chocolate. Okay, let me put my glasses on for reading. Um, dark chocolate whole grain clusters. I got it right from Kroger, okay? And this sometimes you can just sit up and eat like candy. It really tastes good. And you know what else I found out? Check this out. If you get these, you can put this over some vegan yogurt and you can put a little um, you can put a little um, maple syrup over it with your vegan yogurt. And then add some strawberries to it. So you're getting fiber. You're getting protein. Um, and you're getting a great healthy snack. Um, and it's chocolate. Let me tell you what else I did with these. I made me a great protein chocolate smoothie. I used a half a cup of this. I used a tablespoon of Keiko powder. Let me show you my Keiko powder. Raw, raw organic, raw organic cacao powder. This is also anti-cancerous. Okay, it is great for, it has many great benefits. Um, usually people use this one, because see, I love chocolate. So, I usually make me a nice protein chocolate milk like shake like going on. So I would use a tablespoon to a teaspoon of this, depending on your chocolate tooth. I would use probably a cup of this. And let me show you what else. Um, oh yeah, this. Okay, so for my chocolate shake, I use cashew milk. You know, uh, maybe 16 ounces of cashew milk. I then use my dark chocolate whole grain protein clusters. I use my cacao powder. And to sweeten it, I use maple syrup to your tasting, to your liking. And these are all great protein fixers. Okay, keep the monkey off your back. Uh, it keeps you. It keeps you sane. It keeps great protein. Uh, it keeps your body working, you know, great. And you don't have to eat unhealthy if you don't want to. There are great benefits from everything that I just showed you. Uh, I'm gonna put uh, in the. In I'm gonna put in the description box on just great protein snacks. I'm also gonna put in the description box uh, how I made my vegan tuna. Um. And yeah, I just want to come on and show you. Also, 
also you can do a great coffee. Let me let me show you. Let me tell you about that. Let's just say if you're a coffee lover like I am, you can you can make your own coffee. I'm going to show you how to make your own coffee. You want to get some dandelion tea, the wild crafted dandelion root tea. Okay. You want to boil it. And then you want to get you a blender. You want to get your Vitamixer or your blender or whatever you use to blend. You want to put a half a teaspoon to a teaspoon of cacao powder. And you want to add some cashew creamy milk. What's going to give you your coffee taste is the dandel the roasted. You want to get roasted dandelion root. So the roasted dandelion root is going to give you the coffee taste. But you're going to get many, many benefits from the dandelion root. Cacao powder, anti-cancerous, many other great benefits. The cashew milk is going to give you that creamy, you know, sensation of coffee. And then you just go ahead and you put your... Um, maple syrup or jave or stevia in it to sweeten it there's your coffee and it's all great benefits also you're still getting protein and if you really want to do it up put this on top this on top of the coffee okay of the coffee so i just wanted to let you guys know about all these great snacks and i'm going to probably come back later or tomorrow i'm trying to do one video a day okay so please, um, I need you guys to subscribe, like, comment, and also hit the notification button so that every time I come on, you will get your ding and you can see all of our great um, benefits and uh, snack, healthy snacks and healthy treats for the kids. I'm also going to do a video on just a bunch of healthy stuff for kids. Um, really soon this week um I, I have so many things going on in my mind i have so many videos that i have written down for you i have so many <clears throat> um tape videos it's just a lot i have a lot of things so uh also check out our website we have great things on our website to keep you detox to keep your body intact because of what's going on now to keep you healthy to keep you sane uh, we have great, uh, my favorite thing on the website, my favorite product that I make myself is the phaser system. The fa read about the phaser system. You got to go on the website and read about the phaser system. All of our products are really great, okay? Um, and I make them all myself, okay? So I will talk to you guys later, and I hope you enjoyed this video. And remember, subscribe, like, comment, and share. Okay, uh, that would be great support for us, and I will talk to you guys later. Peace and blessings.